Rocking out with six mats this year for the Thunderbird Invitational, and we get rolling in the 113-pound weight class. Lincoln View's Cody Ricker against Wayne Dale senior Dominic DeVault. Ricker with the 8-1 decision, his 25th victory. That is a school record for a freshman. Congrats, Cody. Two more freshmen in the 113, Patrick Henry Schuyler winner, and Columbus Grove's Levi Schrader. Schrader getting the pinfall right there at the 102 mark. He would fall to Crestview sophomore Gavin Grubb in the second round. 220-pound weight class, Coldwater sophomore Austin Hamilton getting the pinfall victory over Crestview freshman Rex Gerardo. Hamilton getting a second round victory as well. He will advance to wrestling tomorrow. Back over to 113 pound weight class, Spencerville junior Nia Hodge Miller working against Swanton Frosch, Vinny Finelli. Hodge Miller getting the pin right there at 231. In the 126 pound weight class, Spencerville junior Carter Miller against Otsego junior Caden Henderson. Picks him up, doesn't set him down gently. Miller getting the 16-7 majority decision win. Miller advancing to tomorrow. 132 pound weight class, Wayne Trace senior Hunter Long just sliding Joey Sawyer around. Lincoln View sophomore getting pinned eventually at the 302 mark. Hunter Long advancing to tomorrow. Outside of the constellation around. That's what we would say they're moving advancing to tomorrow. Grove sophomore Logan Mershman against Ashland Crestview in the 144 pound class. Sophomore Jaden Hedrick. Mershman securing the pin at 240. He was upended in the second round by a technical fall by Bath senior Ezekiel Burkholder. 138 pound weight class, Macomb junior Daniel Rader tangling with Allen East freshman Jacob Pinks. Rader getting the two point takedown here, but Pinks securing the win by pinfall in 316. Pinks wrestling tomorrow after another pinfall victory against Coldwater's Mason Klosterman. And then Levi Grace against Lincoln View sophomore Dylan Hensley. Grace from Crestview getting the takedown and the four to two win action concluding tomorrow at Lima Central Catholic.